local police sergeant is an Oscar nominated film. He's in that film and it was shot right in Orlando. Yeah, we talked with Sergeant Gary Gross today about the honor and how simply doing his job started his movie career. 8-1, she's running north. She's getting ready to cross the highway. We've got a young female. Boom. Sergeant Gary Gross of the Lakeland Police Department still remembers his lines in the critically acclaimed indie film, The Florida Project. That's a scene with DCF and, and we're uh, interacting with a mother and she's just totally upset. Sergeant Gross only in the movie for about two and a half minutes, but part of a crucial scene where real life law enforcement expertise was valuable. The man who lives in here gets arrested a lot. The film stars William Defoe, nominated for Best Supporting Actor in the movie, centered around a six-year-old girl being raised in a cheap motel outside of Orlando. Sergeant Gross's movie career started as a technical advisor for an old friend. This is the, the very first movie, me showing him how to, to hold a gun and to carry a flashlight. His job, showing the actors how to behave like law enforcement. It was very in the moment. We, we shot the whole scene. Now, I was on the set four days. That radio is going. Ne never stops. His full-time gig, though, still public information officer for the Lakeland Police Department. He's now 30 film and TV projects in. So how long does it take him to prep for all this? You know what? How hard is it to play a freaking cop when you've been doing it 30 years? I'm in my 30 year mark. Sergeant Gross also makes money leasing all sorts of official police gear from his 30 years as a law enforcement officer. The property master will call me and say, can you help? And what do you have to, to help me build this fake detective work area? He's retiring in March, planning to spend more time wearing his acting badge. The Florida Project is showing in theaters right now.